The Sanibel constituency remained one of the hot seats in this year's general election, with seven candidates contesting. In the final analysis, youth won over experience. Carla Palmer tells us more. This is Reese Chipman's second bid on the Free National Movement's ticket and his first win as a member of parliament. The majority of the 4,700 eligible voters registered in the Senegal constituency helped him secure his anticipated victory. Um, the per people in Senegal are tired of the same old, same old. They have been pretty much used for election purposes for 40 years. And now it's time to say to the incumbent, well, you know, bye-bye, because, you know, you're not, we gave you 40 years, you came back, we said yes, we said yes, yes. And at some point, you know, you just get tired of um, the broken promises and, uh, and uh, the dream sold. Chipman beat out former Prime Minister the Right Honorable Perry Christie, unseating him after eight terms in office, some 40 years representing that constituency. However, the race was tight, Mr. Chipman winning out unofficially by only seven votes. 1,900 to Mr. Christie's 1,893. As these Centerville residents headed to the polls, they noted publicly what they were looking for in their member of parliament. Looking for someone who's really going to bring, um, you know, good representation to the people. People who are going to um, look after this particular area. Looking for someone who's going to be for the people and not for themselves and for the country to grow economically and not going downhill like we're going down here. That's what I'm looking for. I feel that the FNM has the strongest candidates that represent me. Political novice Chipman says he's committed to the task at hand. Absolutely. I mean, I would not take on a responsibility that I would not give 100% to. What I bring to the table is uh, more youth, more energy, the ability to relate to what we are dealing with right now in terms of Centerville and its entrepreneurial culture versus East Street and its social uh, issues and structures. And so what I bring to the table is creativity, ingenuity, and the ability to get things done, the results, the, the, the um, ability to ensure that a process begins and then there is a result at the end. Carla Palmer, ZNS Network News.